being super cool party people. It is Monday. It's Thanksgiving. Happy Thanksgiving, even though by the time you see this, Thanksgiving will long be gone. Unless you're American, then it's not there yet. Anyway, I'm awake. I've been awake for a while. I have no idea what time it is. Probably just after 10. Oh, it's 10.20. Um, I'm just laying in bed watching YouTube because I'm lazy. Plans today are to get those clothes sorted a little bit better. I also have to go do a big grocery shop and I have to pack because phase two of my crazy month is kicking in tomorrow. I'm working in the morning and then I'm going back to blind channel in the afternoon. <laughs> oh my goodness. So the nice thing is because I knew I was going back, I left most of my clothes there, which hasn't been a problem yet. <laughs> which, I mean, obviously could be a problem very quickly if I didn't have enough clothes here, but I think it's been alright. So I left most of my clothes there. There's just a couple shirts and stuff that I brought back that I want to wear while I was here because at that point I hadn't unpacked anything and so I didn't know if I was going to find anything. Um... So all I brought back was my backpack and my cooler bag. So I just need to repack those things. I need to like fill my little travel conditioner with more conditioner, blah, 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 blah. Uh, but yeah, so I need to pack today, especially because tomorrow I work in the morning and then I have to leave. I have to meet up with the same skipper that came in with me is, is bringing me out. So that worked out really conveniently. So I'll be back in Blind Channel from tomorrow, which is the 15th it was supposed to be the 16th until the 22nd I'll be coming out and I'm up there because they need an extra body and also to run the polling <laughs> booth for election day which is why I need it to advance vote I probably would have advanced voted anyways because it's usually less busy but yeah so woo back to blind channel <laughs> the hilarious thing is though you won't see this until I'm back out from blind channel because the vlogs are so far behind but it is fine um so that's exciting. I'm gonna slowly get up here and start moving and make my bed and have some lunch, I think, and pack, and I gotta make a list of things I need to buy for, like, food. There's some out there. I made a list of the stuff I left out there, so at least I'm winning in that regard. But yeah, that's what's happening today. It's gonna be a busy day. <laughs> Alrighty, so I just finished my laundry. It is, I don't know what time it is one o'clock um and i am so grateful right now because i pulled my clothes out of the dryer and this was in there and it is probably molten lip sole right now but it did not open which <laughs> i'm so happy about because it would have been the worst but that reminds me that i do want to get a different chapstick i bought that one when i was out in blind channel just because i needed some chapstick and it's kind of boring so i'm gonna purchase some chapstick today actually which one is it do I like I don't remember it's minty <laughs> anyways I'm gonna fold my clothes now I'm looking I'm looking at like all my clothes here and it's nice that I can see almost all of them I think I still have a bag under my bed but it's making me realize that I have way too many clothes which is good because that's what I want to realize but we're, we're minimizing, we're getting there. Anyways, uh, chapstick. Uh, yeah, so I'm gonna fold my clothes now, I think, and then I'm going to make myself some lunch, and then I guess start figuring out what I'm gonna pack. Oh, it came so fast, obviously, but seriously. And then, yeah, like I said, I'm gone for a week, and then I'm back, and then there's one more hectic thing happening before the month ends but I feel like I'm slowly I feel like uh even though I've only been like when did I got back Thursday so I'm only here Friday Saturday Sunday month I'm only here for four days but I feel like in these four days I have just even though I took like two days off just powered through and really got a lot of stuff done I'm feeling good about that also my skin looks amazing today oh damn <laughs> um working on that skincare my mom made fun of me the other day but results results. Anyway, I'm gonna stop rambling. I'm gonna fold these clothes and then start to pick out what I want to pack because I have a feeling it's gonna be even more cold out there this time. Even colder. That's the proper English uh, than it was last time and it was quite brisk last time but I picked up that scoop neck black long sleeve and I think that'll help and I also found a pair of 
fleece lined leggings that I think will make a difference. Anyway, I'm gonna stop rambling. We got stuff to do. Alrighty, so it is 1.30 and I am just cooking myself something to eat for lunch, which is terrible, but it's fine. Uh, I folded all my laundry. I've pulled a few pieces that I wanna bring with me. I'm like trying to remember what I have out there. I definitely have a pair of sweatpants, my pajamas, my rain pants. I think I have enough socks and such out there. I might bring a couple extra pairs because wearing my boots I need to double up my socks and so I kind of go through them a bit faster. And I left my rain jacket out there which I hope I don't regret tomorrow because uh, that could suck. Uh, so yeah I think I just need to bring a couple shirts out and then the pants that I'm gonna wear out and I'm gonna bring the fleece pants, fleece tights that I talked about. I just need to give them a wash. We did not wash them in the washer because they're hand wash only rude but I'm glad I checked it so I need to make a list though of things I need to do like if I had put feed myself on this list earlier I might have done it earlier um I don't think I have too too much to do other than just calm down other than just continuing to kind of go through stuff and minimize and think about the future ah, existential crisis anybody but I need to pack for sure, obviously. I need to do my grocery shop. I'm doing that later with my mom when she gets off work. I was gonna meet her downtown, but it's Thanksgiving and there's no buses in this town on Thanksgiving, apparently, which is kind of lame because it would've been so much easier if I could just bus down to meet her and it's kind of far to walk. I thought about it and you know what? Honestly, it's not the distance, it's the hill. Wait, I'm just remembering. I've just... I do this thing where when I walk places or when I, when I envision walking places, I block out a large portion of it. It is actually a really long walk. <laughs> anyway, I have my list made of the food and other things that I need to get before I go out there, like allergy medicine. In the summer, I think I brought two or three bottles out there? Two bottles. I was out there for a week and I was like, oh, one bottle will be fine. I went through the whole thing because I was at the allergy houses so much. Allergen houses. Anyways, so I've made a list of the things I need to purchase. And now I need to make a list of the things I need to do, which includes editing yesterday's vlog and then hopefully today's vlog too, so then I just don't need to think about it. Today's vlog will actually go up on the 24th because I'm 10 days behind, so... We will have time when we get back, but it'll just be easier if I get it done. And um, I'm just gonna go off my list from yesterday and figure it out, hopefully. I don't know, I'm I'm feeling lost. <laughs> I feel like I don't know how to dive in, and which is why I'm rambling and not actually doing anything. Oops, okay, but I'm gonna go now because my lunch should be ready very shortly here. Did I say <clears throat> I was gonna edit and then just lay down and do nothing. I don't remember if I said I was going to edit, but I definitely intended to edit. And then I was like, I don't feel very good. And so I laid down and watched some YouTube videos, but really, I still feel like I want to have a nap, like really badly, but I don't think it's going to happen. I'm editing yesterday's vlog right now. Got another nine minutes of footage to get through. I finally got back to this. My hair is doing a thing, but it's cool. Um, I don't feel like I have been super productive today, um, but I can't, oh, I don't, I don't think I have been. I think I've been doing a lot of nothing, uh, because I, I have been, let's be honest. I don't, I'm rambling now, I know, but my brain is just so like, whoa, all of a sudden, and I don't know why. It is just about three o'clock. Uh, hopefully I'll get this done in the next little while here, and then I have one more bag of clothes, I think. I think. I thought I only had, like, one more yesterday, and then I found an extra one, and then I remembered another one, but I think I have one more bag of clothes that I can go through. I've been doing really well. I don't know if I mentioned it yesterday, but I have a big black garbage bag and, like, a half to three quarters of another one that I'm getting rid of, so I'm doing great getting minimizing stuff, but there are some things, like... I have this shirt, this sweater, in gray, twice in gray. I managed to get rid of one. Uh, the other one, I'm trying to decide if I want to get rid of the gray one, or if I just want to sew up the hole in the armpit, or if I want to get rid of this one. So we'll see. Also, like, there's just, do I really need a sweater that has Pokemon on it? I mean, yes, but do I? 
And then like this shirt I think get rid of. I have like two of these ones. You can't really see them. They're just different colors. So we're getting there and a stitch onesie. Realistically, do I need it? Uh, I'm going to wear it probably for Halloween this year though. So at least I'll have for that. But then I have two thuggies. So this is a collaboration with a brand called Thuggy, um, which is Vancouver based company and I have two of their like long ones. So they're like sweatshirts or hoodies that come down to your knees. I have two of them. Do I really need two of them? Probably not. Do I really need one of them? I don't know. So I'll probably get rid of, I have a bright orange one that has just been my Halloween costume for like the last three years in a row. Cause I just pinned a Jack Lantern face to the front of it. So I'll probably get rid of that one. So there's definitely still stuff I can get rid of and things that I've been putting away that I know that I probably won't ever wear again that I can probably get rid of, but baby steps. And I feel like I'm doing pretty good. They're pretty big baby steps. Anyways, I'm rambling now to avoid editing. So I'm going to get back into editing and then hopefully I'll feel a lot better. I think I need to do some more hydrating and that'll probably help. I can't tell if I'm all snuffly and like I was having a sneezing attack earlier because of allergies or if it's still this cold. I can't tell. And so until that point, we're just gonna try to remember to hydrate. <laughs> so earlier today I was like, oh my skin's looking awesome. And then as the day's been going on, I've been breaking up, which is rude. I just did a face mask though, except I probably should have done the detox one instead of the glow one. But what can you do? I'm sitting in a pile of things in my life. Makeup, bathroom stuff, and makeup. And um, I just sent this picture to my mom, she's at work, of me doing the face mask and then she sent me this one back. She's cool too guys. Anyway, I have decided to go through some makeup here and where else do I have makeup? I think in here and there's some over here and there's probably some in here. And there's definitely some more in the living room because I was just looking at this because I'm trying to organize things and I don't know when I got these and I know mascaras are only supposed to be good for about three months. I was out of civilization for about three months so these ones are definitely no-go. So I'm going to go through my makeup, get rid of some things that I'm either not going to use again or are horribly expired and um, go from there. I think I'm going to try to find... A YouTube video to watch while I do this maybe of someone doing the same thing so I'll feel better about this I don't know I'm not overly attached to makeup to be honest it's just makeup but it's expensive but still it's just makeup anyways I'm gonna go try to collect everything and then see what we can do here okay so I recently went through my makeup and I organized it I can't remember if I threw stuff out or not side note that mask was really great it was the <laughs> Olay Masks uh, Glow Boost. I've talked about these before because one, the charcoal one makes me feel super offensive and two, they're sticks so you don't really make a mess. Anyway, I have gone through my makeup relatively recently. I don't remember if I tossed stuff out. I probably got rid of some of it but then I was like, I'm gonna organize everything but realistically some of this makeup I've had for a very long time. I can think of one palette that I'm pretty sure I still have that I've had for about seven years. I never use it. Why am I keeping it? It's just sentimental because it was like the first real palette I bought. It was a Stila palette. The lighting is terrible. I'm aware. Making it more orange did nothing. Anyway, so I'm gonna go through here, see what I can get rid of. I have a bag. Where did I put the bag? I don't know, but we'll find it. I think that actually went <clears throat> my voice better than expected. Um, I've got this entire bag here of just like stuff either that I've had for ages and never used or had for ages and used but there was like a compact that had gone rusty on the inside. Oops. Um, but I'm down to basically this box here, my brushes, my battery's about to die. And then I have this Tarte blush clutch with a palette in it. Honestly, it feels like the more I just 
get rid of stuff, the easier it is. So that's nice. Next, I'm going to go through nail polish. I have so much nail polish. And guess what I don't wear at all? Nail polish. I've been thinking about getting some acrylic nails recently. But, like, I paint my nails so infrequently. Like, my toenails are still done from just before I went to Blunge Hell in the summer. I paint them so infrequently that either I'll just buy the color I want at the time of, or I will just go pay to get them done. Like, this is a bunch of, like, travel stuff. Um, but give me a second and I'm going to get out the, like, stacks. <laughs> okay, it's not as bad as I thought it would be. Um, I feel like there might be some more elsewhere. Otherwise, oh wait, yes, up here. I'm fairly certain that this box has more nail polish. Give me a second. Yeah, there we go. So that, 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 and that. And I'm sure there's still some more elsewhere. But there was definitely a point when I was super into nails and nail polish and I paint my nails on a regular basis. I refuse to have my nails on each hand the same color, but I just, I really like just boring and plain now. I don't know, it doesn't chip. Um, like I said though, I have been thinking about getting my nails done recently, but if I, like I was, I was looking on Instagram for inspo this morning, but if I do get it done, I'm just gonna go to the salon. So I theoretically don't need to keep any of this, but we'll see, maybe there'll be some shades that I just absolutely have to have. Um, so hopefully this goes well. It is five o'clock now. I still have to do my grocery shop tonight. Uh, my mom gets off at like 6.30, so we'll probably go for dinner and then go do a grocery shop and sort everything, and I need to pack. And so this is me being very productive, and I'm very proud of myself for that because I could easily just go, eh, I'm going away, I'll just pack. But you know what? We're getting this done. Also, I just remembered that those two boxes up there, I think they have like hair dye and skincare stuff, so I might go through those later too, but we'll get there. <laughs> remembering <clears throat> right now how much I hate the smell of nail polish. Anyway, I decided to keep this one. It's a glow-in-the-dark nail polish. I don't know if it still works, but it's almost Halloween, so I figured I'd keep it. Maybe use it for Halloween. If not, just get rid of it. And then I decided to keep this Nail Medic Charcoal Infused Nail Polish. It's just like a really light gray color. And that's it. Even the other ones that I was swatching, that I was like, oh, these ones are kind of nice. I just, I don't see myself wearing those. Even like this one up here, it's a chrome, which is really cool. I just don't see myself wearing them, like ever. I'm not even sure if I'm going to wear these two. Um, and there was also a lot of like dried out gross ones that were really gross. Like I've seen things in nail polish that I've never seen before. So yeah, I put like two full boxes down to two nail polishes, one of which I'm going to get rid of in a couple weeks here. Good job, me. That's a big, big pile down there. I wonder if you can donate those to thrift stores or if they're just garbage. I don't know. I'll figure it out. Uh, but yeah, so that's good. I have still more like shampoos and conditioners to go through over there because I've stopped using shampoo shampoo. I use shampoo bars. I have, I have one somewhere here. I don't know where it went. Um, I've got one in the shower here and then I left one up at Blind Channel because I was just about out of the one that I have here. I love it. I still haven't been able to find a conditioner that I like. I've got this pressed conditioner one. I hate the smell and I hate it, so I'm going to find somebody to give it to. Uh, and then I have an actual conditioner bar somewhere that I like the smell. I just don't like the way that it doesn't really do anything for my hair. So we're making progress. I'm going to try to tidy things up. I think I might be able to get a lot of this stuff into these boxes I just emptied, so that's exciting, and the time is 5.14, so it didn't even take me that long. Yay me! <laughs> I don't feel like this is everything I need to pack, but I think it's everything I need to pack. I mean, I'll have to throw a water bottle in, but it doesn't seem right. Any oh, tech stuff. Tech stuff! That is very important. Anyways, I have changed because I've been in velvet sweatpants all day and I've changed into regular sweatpants and um got my Pokemon shirt on because let's rock it did my hair and um 
soon it'll be departure time because it is 25 after 6 so I'm just gonna finish watching this episode of The Good Place and then um probably be about time to go so that's that's exciting my phone's charging I need to grab some reusable bags but other than that aces okay so this has been like my place for the day for vlogging I guess I am in my jammies now overslept Overtired, I still think is what it should say. I'm actually doing pretty well today because I did get two days of sleep ins in a row. It's um 10 after 10 now, and because I want to try to get this vlog edited tonight before I go to sleep and upload it so I don't have to worry about it, I'm gonna go very shortly. I'm no, not shortly. I'm gonna end this vlog here. I have packed. Mostly it's just my backpack. I think everything's in there, but because I usually use the backpack and bringing in for my work backpack and I have to work tomorrow morning. Uh, I've just got this little small backpack in the corner there. It's the one that I use usually when I travel. Is usually I have that one as my carry-on, although more recently I had a slightly larger one and I really like that because it fit my laptop in it. <laughs> Cannot fit my laptop in that one. Anyway, I am mostly packed. I just have a couple more chargers that I need to put in here in the morning. I have to remember to put a water bottle in as well, but clothing-wise, I think I'm good. Stationery that I need to bring, I think I'm good. So, fingers crossed we're good. I'm not bringing my Switch this time. Well, that's a lie. At this moment, I'm not bringing my Switch. I'm bringing a book instead, so we'll see if that's a good idea or not. I just... I feel like I played a lot of video games when I was there, which is not bad, but I bought and finished. I bought Mario Odyssey just before I left, and I finished the entire game before I left Blind Channel, like, within days. So, that's a problem. Anyway, um, th at the moment I'm not bringing it, but we'll see if that changes. I did download a couple more episodes on my iTunes. This, this time I downloaded an entire season of Survivor. Um, <laughs> and I might download some more, what is it? Psych. Because I haven't watched all of them recently and I might download some more stuff from Netflix. So you know I got lots of options because I just like to fall asleep to things. Anyway, I feel like today has been the day of rambling, so with that I'm going to stop rambling and say thank you so much for coming along on today's adventure, and I'll see you tomorrow when we do very similar things. Good night.